Welcome to the Morning Offering with Father Kirby, your daily call to prayer. Pray with us every day right here on the podcast and in your inbox. Learn more at morningoffering.com. Greetings, friends. Welcome to the Morning Offering with Father Kirby. Today is Sunday, November 19th, and today I'd like to talk about settling accounts. But first, let's pray together. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. O oh, Jesus, through the Immaculate Heart of Mary, I offer you my prayers, works, joys, and sufferings of this day for all the intentions of your Sacred Heart in union with the Holy Sacrifice of the Mass throughout the world for the salvation of souls, the reparation of sins, the reunion of all Christians, and in particular for the intentions of the Holy Father this month. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. Well, happy Sunday, friends. We know that we are still in ordinary time, but we're nearing the end of ordinary time, and we're actually nearing the end of the liturgical year. So Mother Church is drawing from the teachings of the Lord to highlight aspects of eternal life or of judgment. And so, for example, today we hear, again, a parable from the Lord Jesus, and this is about a master who is now asking for the accounting from his servants. And some of those servants were very industrious and very creative, uh, very much zealous for the work that had been given to them, other servants less so. And we see in this parable the Lord praising the hard work and the dedication of the industrious servants and chastising and punishing the laziness and the lack of initiative of the servants who had not been accomplishing much. And so we see this this range and The parable is told to us by the Lord Jesus in order for us, first of all, to get a glimpse of our particular judgment. Friends, that's going to be us (laughs) standing before our master, giving the assessment of our talents, what we did with the gifts and the abilities that he gave to us. That's going to be us. At the end of our lives, that's going to be us standing there in front of him. And we're going to have to tell the Lord God whether we were one of the industrious servants who, who worked hard and we did our best and, and so on, or whether we were one of the lazy servants who were fearful and who hid things and were trying to, you know, kind of take it easy and be comfortable. And, of course, we see the praise and we see the condemnation. The point we have to realize and the decision we have to make is where do we want to be in terms of that range? And that's, that's our call. We have the grace to be the industrious servants. We have talents and abilities. God has blessed us with time. We can do that. We have to make that decision every day. Our human nature keeps wanting us, our fallen nature keeps wanting to, to make us lazy and, and make us see comfort and ease and, and we'll let somebody else do it. I, I've done enough. Or why does it always have to be me? And, and all these things that, that is really just our fallenness screaming out like, no, no, be lazy, right? And we have to respond to grace instead and say, no, 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 no. We're not, I'm not going to follow this fallen nature. I'm going to allow that fallen nature to be healed by grace. I'm going to allow grace to give me the strength to do what God is asking of me, to use my talents well, to be industrious, zealous for the things of my master so that I can praise him and his goodness and I can be ready when it come time, comes time for me to settle my account. And those are our thoughts for today, dear friends. I want to thank you for joining me. I encourage you to keep fighting the good fight. And remember, you can receive daily spiritual encouragement sent right to your inbox when you subscribe to The Morning Offering at morningoffering.com. God bless you. Thanks for listening today. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. The Morning Offering with Father Kirby is a production of Good Catholic, the media division of The Catholic Company. For more faith-filled podcasts and videos, visit goodcatholic.com.